Hello friend, welcome to linuxhelp.com. Today we are going to see about copy cup. Copying files and directories is one of the common task in every operating system. In Linux, we are using the cp command for copying file and directories. Now, see, this is the copy command for the syntax. Copy, option and source and destination. Now we will see some example for the copy command. First one is copying file without using any option. This command will copy the file1.txt file in slash home slash user and music file. If you want to copy that file, you can type enter. And if you want to see the result, ls l on the source path. You can see the result in your file1.txt. Next one is copying multiple files. Type copy. I have three files in this directory. File1.txt and file2.txt and also I have file3.txt I am copying these three files in slash home and if one and music directory type enter and if you want to see the result type ls hyphen l under destination part you can see the result. These three files are copying in here. Next one is copying directory. Copying directory is little bit different. It is used some specific option for the copying directory. This command will uh, copy the directory in test1 directory a destination path is slash home slash user one slash pictures. I am copying this directory from here. Hit enter. If you want to see the result, type ls hyphen l and the destination path. You can see the result in here. Here we are using iPhone R for the copying directory in recursively. Next one is to copy the archive files. Archiving the files to uh, exact files in the directory to copy the one location to another location and and it will copy the link files if any. You can see the list. I have one link file in test1 directory. Now get back and the list and copy iPhone A. iPhone A using for the archive files and directory name this is the source test one and send the destination path destination path now if you want to see the result type ls hyphen l and the view destination path you can see here it will be copied in test1 directory in pictures if you want to see the link files in the directory pictures and type test1 you can see here 
next one is to show begin what is done that command this command will help you oh, what will be doing this command it will be shows before done if you want to see the result type enter i have three files in this folder and it will be copied test1 directory to test directory to pictures directory if you want to see the result type ls hyphen l under destination path type enter you can see the result in your these three files copied from test directory to pictures directory and also the command what will be doing before it will be source the message next one is copying file if any modification or new file adding in the source file it will be only modified files send the following command is cp hyphen vu before you want to see the contents of file this is the source file and also see the destination destination files i have one extra file for the source file in file 4 and here no that file so i am copying if one modification file view start that txt files alt order txt files and destination path you must give destination path if pictures type enter you can see the result only one modification file will be send the destination path now if you want to see the result you can list the destination path and you can see the result in here copied here to here this file next one is we will use the interactive mode in copy command interactive mode is such as interesting mode it will be destination in same file it will be deleted the before the command copying this is the following command to interactive mode command i for the interactive mode it will be asked for the yes or no question for overwriting the files type enter it will be asking copy overwrite it means the destination file in the same name in here type s yes s and no i'm overwriting these three files in destination but one file i am not overwriter you can see the result also type ls hyphen l and the destination path you can see next we will see the four copy files and directories now you can see this is the command for copying forcefully you can type enter it will be source and it will be copied in forcefully here we are using option hyphen f for the copying files or directory in a forcefully next one is we will see the created a backup date of each every copied file this is the command to take a backup for the uh, all files in the txt in txt format uh, the destination path is pictures uh, i don't need to take a backup file so i skip this 
now we can see here backup and simple here some other options are using uh, in here uh, here none and off and here numbered and equal to t this is for the calculate the number uh, numbering file backup and also here simple equal to never these three options will can use also the uh, backup file in copying format next command is remove the destination path while you are copying while you are copying before that this command will proceed it will found any uh, same file in the destination path in source path it will be converted uh, before delete in same file in the destination path it will be deleted and it will source the message you want to proceed type enter sorry a mistake can give correct path next we will see the create hard link when so instead of copying files this command will copy the same file in the destination path it means i node number of uh, source and destination it will take a hard link backup of copy in the file you want to take a hard link backup it will be take a hard link backup if you want to see the result the back on the list file on the cd test one file on the list here and if you want to see the result ls hyphen lvi this command will help you to see the inode number for the file uh, you can see the test two file inode number in here this is the destination path and i am going to source path and here list the inode number here in multiple files you can note only the file that two and here this is this is called inode number in same and then if you want to check a directory inode number <coughs> and get back and see the ls hyphen lvi command you can see here the da test directory i know number and test one directory i know number i'm um, copying hard link in directory p hyphen rl rl for the r for using the directory copying l for the uh, uh, hard link now I'm using test directory and destination path in fully test one directory. I'm copying test directory in the uh, source file of and destination path for test1 directory and it will be copied but if you want to see the result you can go ls l in here test1 directory and cd test one directory and ls hyphen lvi this is a checking for the inode direct inode number and you can see here inode number of test directory now i'm copying this file this directory right now uh, note here 52 5271 for the 
just now copying for directory inode number and this is the differ from the directory and if you want to see the result go to cd test and you can see here ls hyphen l v i and it is the same as well the uh, test of I know number you can see here 5252424 for the file 2 and here 5252424 for the file 2 next one is creating a symbolic link instead of copying files the symbolic link or link files are working only the current directory symbolic link symbolic means link files for the source directory this command will make a, a link file for the uh, test1.txt file in current working directory you want to make a link file you can type enter and if you want to see the result type ls l sorry ls l you can see the link file in here the this is link file for this file next one is copying without uh, following without following symbolic link in source this command will make a symbolic file in destination file file when copy command will found a symbolic file in uh, destination path in source path it will be make a destination uh, uh, path in symbolic link it means uh, still now the file is symbolic file if you want to take a copy you can type enter and if you want to see the result you can type you can see the result ls l and type enter this is the source file and this is the destination file in same directory uh, and this is the link file uh, in founder for the destination file and also the uh, destination file is a link file next one is uh, copying with symbolic link file in des in destination file this command will make a same file in destination it means not created link file in destination file this following command can make a, a copy with a symbolic file this is the command and type enter if you want to see the result type ll you can see here I am copying this file in here but it is not a in a symbolic link file and also you can see the result and we will see the next one is next one is copying file with given a full path this command will shows you so oh, this is the source file in giving full path and this is the destination file in given full path and hit enter this is a overwriter because uh, in in destination file uh, already in a file c file so you can change your file name mm, c1 change one and it enter it will be uh, it correctly copied and if you want to see the result ls hyphen l and the destination path paste and you can see the result in here txt file c1 that's all about the cp command thank you for watching this video